Hello everyone and welcome back to Modern Warfare 3 Zombies. Now, I did go ahead and get the last two mercenary kills with the Tesla field upgrade. Uh, because I realized after I get that, it's not like we're going to keep going in order. We're going to be starting at the beginning again. So, no, I just wanted to get that done so we could throw on the Aether Shroud. Uh, so we are going to be doing Firestarter and Ghosted today, hopefully getting both of them done. But 100 zombie and 20 mercenary kills is a lot to ask for while Aether Shroud is active in one game. That is a lot. Not, I, I can't lie. This one will be easy. Just napalm burst on a gun and then just start wailing on zombies. That's easy. This one is not easy. I'm hoping we can get this done quickly so we can spend most of our time on ghosted but that's essentially our plan uh, so we're gonna be jumping in here confirm our mission edit inventory change operator we're gonna be going with fender and as you can see there I have not played since the reloaded came out and there's a lot of stuff I want to try um, actually that is a lie I did try to play one game earlier with uh, rocket to build up a little bit of cash for us when we jump in and, uh, yeah, I don't think that went well. What the heck? Alright, I'll uh, put on Aether Shroud for our mission. We're gonna go with decoys and thermite. As far as what we're bringing, we do have a mission for an epic ether tool on a shotgun. So, oh wait, that's not what I want. Uh, so we are gonna be bringing in a shotgun, but not just any shotgun. We're gonna bring the Riveter for the sole purpose that we can put the jack purifier on it and i heard i've seen videos that this flamethrower is absolutely broken at the moment uh, so that's going to be a lot of fun to use as far as the rest of this goes we're just going to be increasing uh attack stance hip fire all that good stuff Let's see if any of these stocks will help us out there. Let's see. I want a li little bit, but not a This one kind of helps. We'll grab that. Let's just see if any of these help more. Oops. Got the added filters in. Ah, uh, no. None of that's going to help. And last but not least, let's just double check here. Okay, no. So this is going to be our zombies build. At least currently, or the ribbon, this uh, Jack Purifier is probably going to come off at one point. And then another weekly challenge we have is just using SMG. Uh, we don't have one down here. But we're just going to grab an SMG. We'll grab the Ram 9. It's currently my favorite SMG in the game. As far as how we're going to build it, same, same formula. Just get that hip fire. Get that tax stance. Check the barrels real quick. See, this is how I can build my gun so fast, guys. Don't care about accuracy. Just go through, and I think there is one that will help. Just gotta find it. I think it's this one, isn't it? Oh yeah, there we go. And last but not least, check the stocks. That one helps. And there you go. That's how I like building all my guns for zombies. More bullets, more hip fire. Good stuff. Uh, what else are we bringing in here? Bring that crystal. I try to grab stuff out of my stash because, let's be honest, the stash just it fills up very quick. And just in case, we do actually have a tombstone in there, even though the game crashed. Uh... Then oh, I'm supposed to go aim down sight. Nah, it'll be fine. But just in case we do have a stat or a tombstone in there, we are gonna have essentially all our perks in there. So we're only gonna bring death perception because it's in my stash. I'll see all you guys once the game starts. And survey says game crashing means no tombstone, which means no 45,000 essence and no perks. That seems fair. I went down and literally my game crashed after I went down. Oh well. 
So this needs to be purple rarity. It will be our main gun we use. Um, we'll switch to the SMG, bring that blue. And because we need to get 250 kills with it, we're going to throw the napalm burst on it. So zombies and special zombies. I do want to get a pack-a-punch on here. Got a contract here. You know what? Full send. If it's if it's too much, we'll uh I'm gonna say, is that two now? Yeah. But if that comes out to be too much, we'll switch to the shotgun and just go for it that way. We need to uh oh maybe we should do an ether nest that'll spawn a lot of zombies and possibly give me another napalm burst yeah i did have napalm burst my rucksack after i told you guys i uh, see once the game starts because i'm a moron and didn't put it on there yet didn't put it in there napalm burst kill Need more napalm burst kills, please. The Ram 9's pretty good in zombies, too. What the heck? I mean, obviously, I have it built for, you know, good old tip fire and such, but... No, I need to aim down sight kills. But yeah, honestly, it's doing... Pretty good work, just on its own. I haven't even packed it yet, it's just a blue rarity. Did that count as lighting them on fire? No. Yeah, part of the reason too, why I want a napalm burst on the weaker of my two guns. I thought I could outrun that. No ammo, really. Nah, sorry, fam. A lot. Nope, I've been playing too much Rust. Oh, I'll take max ammo. I just ran out of ammo, man. I need ammo. Okay. Uh, is there another bounty nearby? Oh, there is. I couldn't be happier. I will tell you guys right now, I usually don't bring... Is that what I think it is? No, that's just canned goods. I normally don't bring two guns in. So if we could get an extra napalm burst, and uh, I don't want to say finish this challenge, but finish the weekly challenge, I would be extremely happy to throw, uh, throw the SMG out. It's just one of those things, man. I don't like having two guns. I like being able to run with my fists. Oh, there's a daily challenge for that, too? It's on the second story here. Oh, hello. Right. Well, we'll go, uh... We'll go harass it a little bit. Actually, where is that buy station? You guys may have noticed. A little short on armor plates at the moment. There we go. That's better. They're so cheap. I had to get in the habit of buying them because it's like they're just so cheap. Why wouldn't I buy them? Watch your step. Your HVT can probably smell you coming by now.
There we go. Did we light him on fire, though? Nope. Yeah, we'll throw on the tombstone, just in case the worst happens. Ooh, I want that. How do I get in there? Never mind. Changed my mind on that one. Ooh, but what about this one? Yep, I will be taking that. I will be taking all of that. Okay, where are we going? Got an ammo crate there. I guess we'll go to the weapon stash. We do need a little bit more cash to pack this so that I don't run out of ammo. Run out of ammo as much. Thank you. I'll take that. We got a pretty decent lineup going so far for being about seven minutes into the game. Although I will say we have not made as much progress on the story missions as I would have hoped. Oh, they're coming that way. We'll go this way again. I'll take this insta-kill, but probably not going to use it very much. Let's see, how far away is it? Not that far. We should probably avoid heading over that direction. Unless we're looking to fight the worm. Okay, so it's this one. Oh, that is a bathroom. Oh, there it is. I'm like, where are the stairs in this building again? Uh, I think I just heard a dog. Oh, get me up top, up top, up top. Yeah. With these missions, I always like to have a choke point. That way... I don't ever have to worry about turning around. Just look the one direction. And I take care of the zombies. The only part that sucks is when I have to reload because I don't have a tier one pack. Oh, let me grab that ammo. Hey, friend. We having fun yet? Go try and kill that dog close to there. They're all going to start taking fire damage. Just soften the zombies up a little bit. See, I do like these raid weapon stashes when I have missions like, oh, kill certain number of zombies. Because it just, just makes it so easy. It spawns a bunch of zombies, put them through a certain choke point, and call it good. Let's see, we're almost done. Well done. Allegedly. Another napalm burst. So, put that on there. So once we finish that weekly challenge, we only need about 100 more kills for. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and Swap over. Now, of course, with the purple rarity, pack one, and the flamethrower on it, I have full confidence going into tier two with it already. Okay, so now I just need zombie kills. Let's see how many more? 125 more. We're exactly halfway. So we'll go over here to this bad boy. And 
Honestly, we'll probably... The spores, I can pop and hit fire. But this should also help me... Complete... That, uh, that story mission, too. What else? No? No one else? Did I get all the zombies? I need to reload. And some would say that I should just farm an Xville, but... Oh wait, I hit fired. Just because I can doesn't mean I should. Oh look at that, we're almost done with our zombies too. Once we finish the zombies, we're essentially, I would say, forced into tier 2. So we're going to need more special zombies. They're just so much easier to find in tier 2. I, I thought I was only going to put in one plate. Brain rot, stamina up, turret circuit. I think we're good. Ah, what do I got nearby that'll spawn a lot of zombies? A zombie! How close are we actually? Uh, 161? Need a lot of zombies. Another raid weapon stash over there. Mercenary stronghold, infested stronghold. That's just as far. There's no real cars around. Contract mark. You know, honestly, I'd rather do that bounty contract than try to spend my time. Trying to get all the way over to that raid weapon stash. I'll just kill zombies along the way. Oh, they're up, it's up there. And you don't realize how many 250 zombies is. Hey, we're done igniting regular zombies. Yeah, you don't realize how much 250 zombies is until you're trying to kill 250 zombies. can't survive against me so don't even bother and since we have the napalm burst on the shotgun we are going to use the shotgun to take out the HVG we're just going to use the uh, SMG for all the small fries uh oh hi I didn't realize you'd be right there. Hey, light on fire for me, will you? He is not lighting on fire. Let's go out to the road, my guy. Okay, is it just me, or is the S- Oh wait, kill these guys before we go after him. Nah, let me play it up real quick, my guy. Did we still not light him on fire? Nah, still didn't. 
Let's see. We're almost done with the kills, though. Put another armor plate. You know what? Maybe we'll do the... That just doesn't spawn a lot of zombies, man. I don't want to do escort, though. Fine. We'll do the deliver cargo contract and just kill zombies along the way. That'll at least give us a car. Help move us to the next area. Guess that's really all I can ask for at this point. I need to just kill these zombies real quick before we go. Or? Like how I just shot it a couple times and then just moved on from it. Why do I still hear zombie noises? Don't know. Do I need that? Probably not. Get that garage opened up. We don't want to hang around. Right. I wanted to check for some zombies. Alright, so we'll go drive over there. We already got 10,000, so we could pack to our uh, shotgun if we wanted. Oh, you know what we should do? We should get out of the vehicle right before we finish the challenge. Or the mission. Kill all the zombies by hand. We're going through here. Is that the plan? I didn't actually check the map to see where I'm supposed to go. I kind of just said full send. Oh, look at all those zombies. Okay, can't run over hay. Ah, we'll just run over the zombies. It's fine. There we go. See, there's plenty of zombies still around for us. And I'll take a free dead shot. Okay, how, how much are we? Okay, we're almost done. So we are going to move into Tier 2. And worry about getting the last couple uh last couple zombie kills with tier two. I say that and then I proceed to just shoot the zombies around me. Alright, I need to reload for you. Man, are you guys gonna finish my weekly challenge right now? It's like a side quest at this point. Now we need five more zombie kills. Alright, let's see. So we're going to head into tier two now. And where are all the contracts, man? Contract mark. It's four? Yeah, I guess we could... Oh, we'll hit the Pack-a-Punch first. That's what we'll do first. I'm not going to worry about these zombies. Maybe if I find a group of five, I'll just get out and finish them all real quick. Just to drop the SMG. That's a group of five zombies. Okay, that should have been five kills, right? One more. There we go. Why am I so zoomed in? I wish I could change how zoomed in I am on my vehicle, but that is a set value. Not a very good one either, just a set value. Okay, 
Ooh, raid weapon stash. That's actually a nice contract. Full send. Vehicle somehow didn't take any damage doing that. I don't know how that's possible, but hey, you know what? We're not going to ask questions. Ah, here we go. Pack a punch right down here. Now we've got purple. Pack two. Boom. You'd love to see it. Now this purple pack two shotgun is just going to tear through tier two. Need boss zombies. No, I guess spawn. Contract marked. Oh wait, no, the weapon raid weapon stash will actually spawn a mangler at the end, if I remember correctly. I'll go this way for it. I think this road will take us right over to it. Maybe. Not going this way. There we go. Yeah, if I'm not mistaken. Ah, oh, it's up the hill. Okay. Oi! Get me off of that. See, now we can run with our fists out, which is significantly faster. Uh, let's get up there. Get some boss zombies, hopefully. Oh, okay, you guys are coming from that way. Ah, uh, just leave me alone, zombies. Go ahead and pop that into attack stance. Easy. Alright, now let's get moving. Real quick, get this started. Slow movers closing on you, strike. One right in between their blowing eyes. With any luck, it should spawn a mangler at some point, if I remember correctly. Man, it's been a while since I used a, uh, Shotgun in tier two. This is not as good as I remember it being. I mean, it's doing the work, though. You may also have noticed that I have yet to use the, uh, the flamethrower on it. That's because I don't know if I'm ready to use the flamethrower on it. So, for those of you who are blissfully unaware of everything going on in the world of Modern Warfare Zombies... Let me show you why... This flamethrower is absolutely broken. I just need to find a zombie first. Uh, maybe there's one over here. God, I just can't seem to find a zombie, guys. One zombie's all I need to show you how broken this thing is. I probably shouldn't get too far away from this. Zombies should come to me, right? Man, I just can't seem to find any zombies. Put us. Oh, wait, there's our mangler. There we go, we lit him on fire. Yeah, that's how broken this is. 
I haven't even picked up that insta kill. That's just how powerful the flamethrower currently is. Oh god, get out of the menu! I literally couldn't get out of the menu. The only thing is, when you pick up ammo off the ground, the flamethrower does not refill. Okay, let's see. We should have a mimic in the ether nest right here, right? Right? Is there going to be a mimic in here? Go ahead and just use this. I was like, there's no way I just broke my gas mask. Okay, so the flamethrower is useless against cysts. That's good to know. I'm not seeing... I'm like, I'm not, I'm not kidding. I expected there to be a mimic in here. Ooh, there's a Disciple nearby. There he is. Oh wait, no, don't use the Flamethrower against the Disciple. I need to reload. Stop it. I need to light that Disciple on fire. Oh god. Alright, I need to clear out some zombies real quick, though. Alright. Well, that's better. Zombies, do I need to clear you out again? Hey, stop it. Oops. I just didn't want to get my... My life sucked out of me, man. Oh, where was the last one? Oh. There's the mimic. There we go, lit him on fire. Does that mean one more? Only we lit that disciple on fire. And we should try to keep our eyes peeled for an ammo. Actually, wait, will max ammo give it to us? No! Wait, does that mean that there isn't a special crate in here? Damn! That was harsh. There's an ammo crate over here. And an infected stronghold. You guys feeling another mimic? I need a plate up first, though. Right. One problem. I would like to find that ammo cache. No. Oh, mimic. Yeah. Alright, minute. I'll be with you in just a second. God, I just... I hate looking down. There we go. Alright, so now we can do the Ether Shroud one. And so now this is where that flamethrower is going to come in real handy. Let's just spawn a bunch of zombies. Now she get us a nice horde behind us, right?
Ah, come on. There's gotta be more than just four of you. Come on. There we go. That's a little bit better number. That hurts. Put that down, get you all in one spot. There we go. I was getting concerned for a second there. All right, we'll get ready. Alright, how many do you think that was, guys? 30! <laughs> we need to do that a lot more times. Which means I need to kill a lot more zombies. Ow. Thankfully, I don't think this one takes as long to charge up as that Tesla storm does. Well, someone's working on the uh, Act 2 story mission, it sounds like. Oh god, I need a reload. God, why is it bouncing around so much? There we go, that's what we like to see. Lots of zombie kills. Oh, bad mangler. The shotgun doesn't do bad. Which is not as good as I remember it being. Take a Casimir. We'll take one of those with us, not both. A three plate vest. Another Casimir? Man, you would swear we're preparing for a war. I should probably play it up, shouldn't I? Okay. Uh, we do need to kill mercenaries, but. Contract mark. No, I don't think that's something I can do. Actually, you know what? Do we get more... Does our perk charge faster in Tier 3? Am I really asking that question right now? Listen up. That camp is heavily guarded. Smoke out that hornet's nest. Yeah, yeah. The idea is to watch me leave. I don't think I've ever done a sport control over here before. Barrera received a stress call from one of his teams. Make for broadcast location and render aid. Miller here. Oh, I need to drop something. Sent that squad in with an ether inhibitor after detecting some cyclonic aberrations. You wouldn't believe the physics hmm. surrounding. No time for that, Barrera. Just what am I tossing out? Third circuit, I guess. I'm sorry, did, were you guys upset that I walked away from you? I ignored you. Is that, is that what you guys wanted? I think that's what they wanted. Whipped. Yes. 
Oh, okay. Oh, that's a max ammo. Oh, I guess we could... Does that work on this? Very poorly, actually. Good night, Mangler. Actually, I think if we just come back to the box, it'll rebuild faster than me actually trying to pick them up. There we go. I just gotta make sure to keep putting on plates. Now we'll get this one. Jump through here. Get that one. Oh, Aether Shroud's ready again. Okay. So we're gonna try and ignore the zombies for a moment. I'm gonna go grab the other two. And try to get a horde of zombies behind us. Stop it. I want a horde. Okay. Oh, out of tactical ammo because I forgot. I'm using. Uh, get that ready. I want you guys all to kind of be somewhat together when I do this. The disciple counts, right? Oh, I'm out of it already. Oh, ran out of ammo. I hear you behind me. Oh, I need to go break those spores before the inhibitors need to be placed again. Uh, there's one. There we go. You guys have a thermite. That thermite was not as effective as I wanted it to be. Ooh. Dead wire formula? I don't know if I need that. We'll go ahead and, uh... Oh, and I'm a moron. Okay, that's cool. Deadbolt actual to strike team. Animal crate. And recover Dr. Jansen. No diversions. Uh... Coming up in your AO. Great. Contract mark. I guess we'll go into Tier 3. Just trying to think the most effective way to do this, guys. Actually, no, it wouldn't be Tier 3. It'd be... Weapon stash, probably. Ooh, what's that in there? I can't go through that window. No, that is opened, is what that is. Where was the... Where was the ammo stash? Should be, like, right here. Oh, is it on the second floor? No. Oh, the roof. No. Okay, well, I guess I don't need the flamethrower. Oh, I thought I could. Sorry about that. Yeah, I just realized I have a surprisingly lack of armor plates. Stop it, Disciple. There we go. Got a few armor plates now. I guess I don't know where that ammo stash is, so we're just gonna move on. I'm actually tempted because we've got enough money to run into Tier 3. 
No, let's uh equip the Casper. What else am I gonna use them for? We're just gonna exfil them and not have them anymore. Okay, you know what? Maybe Ammo depot here. Maybe. I'm torn on going into tier three right now. I mean, if we are using a Riveter, honestly, it's not really Tier 3 material. But we do have Ether Shroud active, and we do have the Flamethrower. Tier 3 is known for its massive hordes. Alright, we're going in. We're going to avoid that Mangler, though. We're going to go get that ammo cash. Alright, you know what? Fine. You guys wanted that. You guys wanted that so badly. Oh, man. See, look at that. I should really have a decoy active so I can use these guys. Okay. Throw down that decoy. Let's see what we can do. I would consider that pretty good work that we just did. Let's see, yeah, with the flamethrower, tier 3 is a joke. Alright, so let's get this raid weapon stash. We're gonna chill here, though. So we can use this again. Actually, while we're waiting for that, let's see if we could uh, find some local zombies. There, I should figure them to come up here for me. Ooh, armor. Ah, oh, I love having GHD. Anyone else? I'm trying to charge my field upgrade. No? Okay, well. This ammo reserve's already full. What? Okay, so I guess I can only... Oh, I forgot about that. They all go to that side. That's awesome. I think that means that all I have to watch is right here, right? If I remember correctly. Which should be pretty easy. See, look at that. If that's not overpowered, I don't know what is. I just wanted to get a chance to use it before we lose it forever. Wait, am I too far away? Oh, they got rid of that strategy. That is... That's fucked up. You can't stand over there with a raid weapon stash and actually complete the contract. And here I am goofing off. Okay, I need to... Now can I refill? Yeah, see? Oh, God. I'm doing something wrong. Yep. I recommend you find an exfil point. 
Okay, this will work now again. Ooh, I'll take that. Yeah, I think we're just going to cancel this contract. Alright, we'll uh, go back to the shotgun. No reason to waste insta-kill. We are actually... Oh god, okay. That's a lot of zombies. There we go. Uh, so let's go ahead and cancel that. Yeah, I'm not so concerned about the risk. More so I am. Ether Shroud's available. I like it. Uh, let's see if we can find a horde. There is a mimic. Hey, friends. You guys coming? How about you guys? Here, you guys focus on that right now. I'm gonna gather up some more friends. I need as many of you guys to be all over here as possible. Oh yeah, look at that. Let's just get all of them. Kill them all. <laughs> 43, that's all we're at. Oh my god. Okay, Mega Abomination, I'm gonna level with you. I'm not doing that today. Oh, by the way, where's the pack? Be a shame to show up to tier 3 with enough cash and not pack a punch my weapon. Don't you guys agree? Okay, dog. I don't have any more, uh... See ya, guys! Ha ha ha! Grand escape. Alright. Uh, can you guys help me, uh, charge up my field upgrade? Or just drop a full power? I don't need double points, I need full power. And then I think we're gonna make our way over. Yeah, I'll try not to hit the car. I want to use the car. Ah, right, let's get out of here. Final exfil is probably gonna be somewhere over there. On that side of the river. So, we're gonna head over there. Actually, if we could keep the car alive, we can head over to that Xville, farm it a little bit, and then just keep moving along wherever the next Xville is. I think that's gonna be our play. To get the Aether Shroud charged up, and to get Aether Shroud kills. Uh, these, uh... These field upgrade missions, they are a lot harder than you'd think they'd be. The energy mine one was super easy, actually. The frost one was a pain, but that's because it specifically wanted mimics. The Tesla, once I learned how to use it, got a lot easier. This one's just a pain. And the field upgrade is great, don't get me wrong. I'm not shitting on the field upgrade. It's the one I run the most. Just the sheer numbers. Uh, here's tier one. Once we get out of this tunnel, we'll be at the Xville point. Stronghold ahead. Terminus won't give There's a lot of cars here. Reinforcements if you choose to engage. 
And these are tier one zombies, so they should pop immediately. The only thing I'm gonna really have to be careful of is, uh... Okay, just use it because there's a uh, full power over there. Go down, Mangler. We're definitely not get. Oh, uh, we're about to easily clear out the uh, zombies part of it. What's that? Oh no. Yeah, no, the plan is actually quite the opposite. What's that? Bonus points? Hey, where was that? There we go. That's how you do it. Yeah, no, please get out of here. Yep. Needed me some insta kill, that's why. And there are so many people that X filled here, that's crazy. Now with any luck, car just exploded. That's not a good sign. There we go. Now this should light up again pretty soon. Maybe. I don't know how we're going to get the 20 mercenary kills this game, though. I don't think it's possible. Ooh, all of a sudden, I don't think this is lighting up anytime soon. And once again, I'm the last guy in the map. So honestly, I think we'll just hit the last 11. Okay, we're going to just run around a bit. Back up some zombies. So we get at least 11. That look like 11? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. I'm going to venture to say that's at least 11. Was that 11? Yes. Okay. Good, good, good. So yeah, we'll just go ahead and next kill then. Because we're not getting the mercenary kills this time. Uh, Storm is also here. Yep, I'm already on board, so let's just get out of here now. I get my first containment level, too. Nice. First successful exfil since uh, Season 2 Reloaded. <laughs> we got our napalm. Ooh, start with five armor plates. That's nice. Uh, what else did we do? I don't know if I needed dead wire. I forgot. I don't think that's one that I needed, but just in case. Ah, right, so we got all our napalm, and we got the Aether Shroud zombies. Still need to get those mercenaries, though. Other than that, I would call that a pretty darn good run. If you guys enjoyed this, please drop a like. If you guys want to see me struggle through some more Act 3 missions, follow me and subscribe, and I'll catch all you guys next time.